Good afternoon, everyone. It's JT at Polito for Sync Media Network. You guys asked for it. You know we deliver. Everybody's clamoring for the Tesla Soup product, and you sent us an email with what you wanted us to cover, and I'm here with Dimitri, Hi. who Hi. is the Chief Revenue Officer, so he right. knows everything. And I gave him the list of questions he'll answer. Go ahead, Dimitri. Comes, comes with the job. Yeah, so today we're presenting our new Tesla Suit Glove, uh, and uh, uh, Tesla Suit Glove comes uh, with four distinctive technologies, so we have haptical feedback onto the tips of our fingers, uh, it's a 3x3 three three, uh, haptic screen. Uh, it comes with an exoskeleton part which allows us to feel the resistance of the object so we can actually grab it and hold it. Uh, it comes with biometrical sensing uh, technology which allows us to read uh, over 82 different parameters and biometrics. And it has motion capture which works wirelessly uh, as a standalone set of gloves um, and allows us to actually manipulate the interfaces in, in the way it should be in XR. Cool. And I think they said it's uh, it's not going to be available to consumers for a while. There's no way, uh, and it's not going to be for gaming. It's mostly for industrial and things like that, which the healthcare and all the good things about it. And what was one of the other questions? Yeah, price and availability. Yes. 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 Yeah. Oh, go ahead. Sorry. <laughs> um, Tesla Suit is known uh, quite well in business solutions, in enterprise solutions, so uh, we're also going into high science uh, and medical science. So currently the glove is not being eyed for the consumer market. The, our price tag is around $5,000 per pair. Uh, However, uh, we will always have a consumer in mind and we eventually will come there. Don't, don't worry guys, uh, we, will, we already have the technology to make the Tesla suit available for the consumer and the glove will just arrive there. We just need a bit more time to build up uh, volumes and that's when we will be able to uh, give you the device that you all want. That's standard guys, don't pick on them. <laughs> that's the best way and always. And I think the last question, will it, you, connect to what was it steam vr or something steam vr yeah. well uh yeah we can cover that as well right now uh at tesla suit we created the sdk and open api so we not only we can integrate with unreal engine unity cry engine and existing games um uh, we started develop uh, developing something for a few years from now um, but also we have, because of the open API, we can connect to any type of software, being a proprietary, being the, the engines that we didn't even see before. Uh, it's a fairly simple process. Outstanding. Thank you. Right. You got everybody off my back. And now you guys <laughs> better share this with everybody else on Sync Media Network on YouTube. And I want to thank Dimitri well, thank who you gave coming. us every single answer. Thanks, guy. I appreciate it. Outstanding product. Okay. Good luck in the future. Thanks. <laughs> I'm going to send it back to you in the studio. It's JT Ippolito for Sync Media Network. We'll give you one last look at the glove. Oop, can't do it with looking at the light. <laughs> there you go. Much better to see it that way. I've seen it. Seen it a little bit of action. It's amazing. Back to you in the studio, JT Ippolito for Sync Media Network. Bye.